Assalamu alaikum, my brothers and sisters. Peace be upon you. Today, we will explore an intriguing and important topic, Al Al Kitab, or people of the book in Islam. Have you ever wondered what this term signifies and who it encompasses? Stay with us as we delve into this subject in detail. Who are the Ahl al Kitab? In Islamic terminology, Ahl al Kitab refers to followers of monotheistic Abrahamic religions that possess revealed scriptures. This primarily includes Jews, Christians, and occasionally Sabians. Let's examine these groups more closely. Jews, followers of the Torah, known in Arabic as the Torah. Christians, adherents of the Gospel, or Injil in Arabic. Sabians, a lesser known group sometimes considered among the people of the book due to their monotheistic beliefs. Key aspects of Al Al Kitab in Islam respect and recognition. The Quran acknowledges the scriptures of the people of the book and recognizes their prophets, establishing a foundation for mutual respect and understanding. Dietary laws. It is permissible for Muslims to consume meat from animals slaughtered by the people of the book, provided it adheres to specific conditions, thus making it halal. Interfaith marriage. Muslim men are permitted to marry women from the people of the book. Such marriages are subject to certain conditions, highlighting a spirit of interfaith harmony. Dialogue and coexistence. The Quran encourages respectful dialogue and coexistence with the people of the book, emphasizing shared values and beliefs. Differences in belief. While acknowledging the people of the book, the Quran also addresses theological differences, such as the concept of the Trinity in Christianity, which Islam does not accept. Quranic references. Several verses in the Quran refer to the people of the book, including Surah Al-Baqarah 262. Indeed, those who believed and those who were Jews or Christians or Sabians, those who believed in Allah in the last day and did righteousness, will have their reward with their Lord and no fear will there be concerning them, nor will they grieve. Surah Al-Ma'idah 5.5 This day, all good foods have been made lawful, and the food of those who were given the scripture is lawful for you, and your food is lawful for them. And lawful in marriage are chaste women from among the believers, and chaste women from among those who were given the scripture before you. These verses reflect the nuanced and respectful approach Islam takes towards the people of the book, underscoring both commonalities and distinctiveness in religious beliefs. Thank you for joining us in today's exploration of Al Al Kitab in Islam. If you found this discussion informative, please like, comment, and subscribe for more content. Don't forget to click the bell icon to receive notifications of our latest updates. Until next time, peace and blessings.